They call me Lassie. You need somebody. I will never let you down. I will find the key. You can trust in me. I'm a friend to everyone. And I go, go under the rainbow. I will hear you call. You call. And I go, go, never take it slow. I actually saw the ghost! Whoa, Goldie. Calm down. I believe you. Did you see the ghost's features by any chance? I only saw his eyes, I'm afraid. I didn't know oh, what it was, but I didn't want to risk seeing it again. It might haunt me for life. I don't think there's anything to be scared of, Eagle. This is our ghost golden eagle. Guys, this is Wolfgang Lincoln. Lincoln, this is Nathan and Golden Eagle. It's very nice to meet you both. Nice to meet you too. So, that was your lies I saw in that building? That's right. I'm sorry if I frightened you. I didn't intend to, you see. Oh, that's all right, Wolfgang Lincoln. Oh, please, just call me Lincoln. It's much easier that way. Very well, then, Lincoln. <gasps> L Lincoln? The Lassie? Lincoln! I missed you so much. I missed you too, honey. Honey? Lassie, what is going on here? Why did I tell you? Wolfgang Lincoln here is my boyfriend. It's true! Lassie told me recently that she had been feeling homesick because she missed Lincoln after she left to join me here in England. That makes me curious. How did you get to England and why are you here, Lincoln? Well, the reason why I'm here is obvious, isn't it? I wanted to be reunited with the girl of my dreams because I began to miss her a lot. Aw, oh, Link. And how I got here, as I couldn't buy a ticket due to being an animal, I snuck my way onto a cargo ship at the docks in America. I chose that one because I heard it was headed for the UK, and I'll tell you, those few weeks on that ship were absolute hell. I had to keep myself hidden from the crew, and I stole food while they weren't looking. Fortunately, they never found me on the ship, and just assumed that some crew members were being clumsy and accidentally dropping food overboard. Eventually, we arrived at Southampton Docks, and once I got off the ship, I wandered around and saw a poster for Furry Railways. That was when I remembered Lassie was there. I then looked on on how to get there, so I snuck onto a train and kept myself hidden in it all the way to London. Once in London Waterloo, I snuck onto the London Underground trains to King's Cross and then got on another train from there and kept hidden in it before eventually arriving at the Furry Kingdoms. It was late at night when I arrived, so I decided to rest in that old station for a little while to get my strength back after all that traveling. Then a short time later, you guys came along and found me, and well, here I am. Wow, Lincoln, that must have been some adventurous journey you took to get here. Indeed, but since it helped me reunite with the collie I love, that journey felt good and it was well worth it. And the best bit is, I'm staying here with you, my love. Oh, Link. Aww. I'm glad you're happy again, Lassie. I'm a lot happier now, Bambi. Hold on, Golden Eagle. Aren't you forgetting something? Uh, no. What? That bet you made with Sir Francis Drake yesterday? Bet? What bet? Uh, uh. Goldie, you fool. You got 100% frightened of a wolf dog whom you thought was a ghost. Hmm. <laughs> you know what this means, don't you? God freaking damn it! <laughs> I just don't know, Bambi. What if Lincoln thinks I'm crazy and dumps me for some other dog? 
Nonsense, Lassie. Link Kid would never dump you for someone else. Give it a try and tell him. I'm sure he'd want the same thing. Well, if you say so. Hey, Lassie baby. Hey, Link. You okay? Yeah, um, Lassie? Yeah? You know how much I love you, right? Of course I do, Link. And I love you too. But why? Well, I was thinking, I think it's time we brought our love to a whole new level. In, uh, what way? Well... Really? Yes, I really want that. Well, Link, your luck. I am? How so? Okay, so it's been agreed that Optimus Prime and his fellow Autobots will defend the Furry Kingdoms from Megatron and his Decepticons. I know they are big robots, but I assure you the Autobots are here to help us. Well, Daniel, if you can trust those big robots with the blue eyes, then I'm sure we can. Very good. I'm a little worried about Lassie. She looks like she's fallen sick. Is she doing okay, Lincoln? I think so. I just left her to sleep in so she can rest. I think she's been feeling pains in her stomach, but apart from that, she seems fine. I just really hope she's not di- Lincoln! Lassie, are you okay? I'm better than okay! I just did a test, and it turns out I don't have an illness. It's something way better than that! And what is that? Lincoln, I'm pregnant. Wait. Lassie is having babies! Yes, I am! Congratulations, Lassie. Who's the father? Uh... Uh... I am. Lincoln? You're the father of Lassie's pups? Uh... Yes. This is great news! Congratulations, Wolfgang Lynn Cullen! Not only to have a beautiful collie as your mate, but also to be a father of her babies! Thanks, Louis. How many pups are you having, Lassie? I haven't really found out that bit yet, but when I do, I'll let you all in on it. I can only imagine how lively our pups will be when they're born. Oh, ho, 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 ho you wee rascals! Well, hopefully they won't be so annoying like Billy or Ernest. Oh, ho, 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 Oi! Oi. And let's talk of that from you, Golden Eagle, or I'll see to it that Lassie and Lincoln's pups get to use your tender as their litter tray. Oh, you just got dominated, Golden Eagle! <laughs> <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.